Inside this bar. No, she's going to be here like any minute. There's a woman with a problem. Excuse me? And she wants you to help her out. My mother's in town, and she's expecting to meet my new boss. But actually, I got fired last week, and I don't want her to find out. Do you think maybe you could pretend to be my boss for a few minutes? Please? If a woman asked you to lie... Please? OK. Oh, my gosh, OK. Um, if she asks, your name is Mr. Phillips, and you're a computer engineer. About being her boss. Oh, here she comes. <laughs> Just act normal, OK? Hi. Thanks for coming. Oh, I am so glad to meet my daughter's boss. Tell me everything. What would you do? We're at the Blue Moon Cafe in Englewood, New Jersey. And one of these men is about to be recruited. Excuse me? I'm sorry to interrupt your lunch. My mom is coming to town any minute, and she's expecting to meet my new boss. But I recently just got fired. And I was wondering if one of you would help me pretend to be my boss for just a few minutes. What am I pretending to be your boss in? Uh, computer engineering. Would you do it? Sure. And okay. just like that, he's on the hook. So computer engineering and um, Mr. Phillips is your last name. And now mom is on her way in. Hi, mom. And there's no turning back. Oh, so good hi. to see you. You too, darling. Come on in. This is Mr. Phillips. Hi. I am so glad to meet my daughter's <laughs> boss. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. I'm so glad that you see the potential in her like I do. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what's your favorite characteristic about Lauren? Yikes, he's only known Lauren for about five minutes. I... <laughs> She's been very outgoing. Oh, yes. Meet the people in the office and kind of ingratiate herself to other people. Yeah. That's wonderful. He's obviously a very speedy judge of character. Apparently, it takes after you. Oh, yeah. Oh, flattery will get you everywhere. I'm just going to run to the bathroom, Mom. I'll be right back, oh, okay. OK? But will flattery get him through a one-on-one -on -one with our mom? All right. Um, in her future, do you see a promotion and with a little raise, maybe? I don't know. Uh, we'll have to deal with that when it, when it comes. Nice job deflecting that question. Now, how will he avoid this next one? Why don't you join us for dinner? And then we'll do some karaoke afterwards. Before he can come up with any excuses, it's time to let him off the hook and in on our little secret. <laughs> now, if this had been a guy instead of an attractive young woman, would you have stepped in? I would probably still be eating my lunch right now, if we're <laughs> speaking honestly. I was wondering if one of you could pretend to be my boss for just a few minutes. Let me think about that more. Yeah. Could you pretend to be my boss for like a few minutes? Oh, okay. Okay. Throughout the day, Lauren does very well recruiting reliable bosses. Okay. This man plays the role with confidence. What's the name of the company again? Felix Gapoy. Yes. Oh. Yes. And this woman kills the role with kindness. First off, her intelligence yes. was beyond recognition. I feel that her character also was very, just protruded out of like, like it was coming out of her pores. Our mom conducts a thorough Q&A. Why did you hire her? Oh my God. <laughs> She's tough. This woman makes a promise that'll be tough to keep. Do you know at what point the star of your office can expect a raise? Um... Couple of three months. Oh, yeah, it's still nice. That's so. good. That's excellent. She even addresses some awkward questions. Lauren told me about the divorce. I'm very, very sorry. He didn't deserve you. Are you yeah, dating now? No. And this woman? Uh, she flatly refuses to play along. Uh, <laughs> don't be mean or 
I start any trouble. I've just met your daughter like a few seconds ago. She she's new. I you know, and I just started, so. Hi guys. <laughs> you wouldn't go along with it. She may look sweet and innocent, but I don't know her, so. You were very kind. No, She's a stranger. She, she seemed like a nice person and just wanted to help her because I know as a mother, you don't want to hear your daughter's got laid off or something. Lauren's back at the bar one last time. Excuse me? Would you pretend to be my boss for just a few minutes? Pretend to be the boss? What's the yeah. company? <laughs> <laughs> it's just uh, computer engineering. Looks like she's found a team player. Why did you hire her? What made you hire her? She has a great personality. Oh, okay. <laughs> Before he can order lunch, this former basketball player is about to be passed some technical questions. Any sort of uh, like computer skills that she has that you would particularly appreciate? Well, I suppose, you know, she, she has all, all the basic tools that you need in today's, uh, you know, working environment. Mm -hmm. you know? Nice job, but how will he do with something more personal? But I'm told you have four children. What are their names? Yeah. Four children. Mm. Valentina. 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 Um, well, two of mine and two of that one. Do you have pictures that you could show me? Pictures? Yes. I don't. <laughs> And one last question for the road. What's the name of the company? I'm blanking. <laughs> so. We're still trying to figure it out. <laughs> How much more can you take, man? <laughs> Where are you, brother? Man, you're a great sport. I mean, I, I, I tried. I, you were trapped. <laughs> I was trapped. <laughs> Why did you agree? I thought it was being a good Samaritan. <laughs> and who says a good Samaritan can't tell just a little white lie?